All right, Cubs, how's it hanging? Just want to let you know, this video is sponsored by Huawei AppGallery, bringing great offers for Age of Z. All right, Cubs, so what we do first is go on to AppGallery, and then we change the country region to Italy, Netherlands, or Greece, and then we go on to Age of Z. Then it'll bring you to the Age of Z offers page. Now, the first offer you can see at the top is the 50% cash back in Huawei points on your first purchase then a favorite 20% after that then they got the additional offers at the bottom so offer one is a free Huawei app gallery gift code and all you gotta do is type in app gallery gift offer two is additional 20% cash back in Huawei points just remember one Huawei point equals one euro offer three is a free four euro coupon and then they have their own Discord server for App Gallery, but they also do have a bonus VIP for those who spend over a thousand euros a month. They give an additional 15% cash back on top of that. Now, I'm just going to go to the next screen and just show you how to use the coupon and how it all works. So, we'll take it into the game here. You click on any pack you want, so here, Lucky Coins, for instance. So, you just collect the Lucky Coins. Automatically deducts off the percentage. So when you click next, it will take you to the terms and conditions. Read it if you feel like it. I don't anyway. But this campaign does end on the 30th of June. All right, Cubs, how's it hanging? So there was a rumor that there's a bug on the tower defense and the infinite zombies. So I went on to level 21 on the hard difficulty on tower defense because that is the only one. I don't have three stars on. I only have one star. I can't even manage to get to two stars. So with this bug that's rumoured, I decided to test it out. Now I didn't record it live because I didn't know if I was going to achieve it or not. I didn't know if I was going to hit the max three stars with it or anything like that. So I, this is me doing a voiceover on top of it just to make sure that I did achieve it. Now I can confirm that the bug is true. It does exist. And it is on your lasers. And this has actually helped me to achieve three stars on level 21 difficult hard difficulty tower defense so i'm going to show you how what i mean uh, so far that i've only noticed is that the bug is on the lasers didn't really pay attention to the others because it was a, well, a chat that i heard someone said it was on the lasers and then after i did this other people started saying well actually it's on the turrets as well so if you can see it within the video that is on the turrets then, fair enough. But at this time, I only pay attention to the lasers. I didn't pay attention to the turrets or the rocket launchers. So we'll just see how it goes. But like I said, 100%, the bug is within the lasers. And I will tell you now, take advantage of it because it is in the both tower defense and infinite zombies. So on tower defenses, if you haven't got three stars in anything to get the max rewards, do it now before they fix it guarantee any game such as age of z when they see a bug and if it's a bug that actually helps us and not themselves they look to fix that immediately because then it stops them getting even money or anything like that from whatever you need so they do try and fix the bugs that benefits us try to get it fixed as soon as possible so as you can see i've got a basic set up um I didn't go for my usual setup because it only always achieved me one star. I tweaked a few things to my original setup, which obviously you guys don't know, but I thought this was the first time and I actually completed these three stars on the first try. I didn't have to replay it. I didn't have to, you know, start up and start. It was just a straight run through and I couldn't believe it. When as soon as I hit it, I was proper happy. So as you see here, I've just upgraded a few of my other like lasers turrets. I know I didn't go, probably some of you are asking why I didn't go, for, you know, like, you still go for turrets instead of lasers. Simply because the turrets aim for the little guys. When the lasers get distracted by the yellow life guys, you'll see that turret there. You pay attention to the other ones just to reduce their life by the time they come down to the bottom line. So this is why I use turrets as well. Because I know they focus on a single target. When the rockets to a blast radius but in the end the turrets will make sure that none of the little guys get through 
you see here, he got quite close for my liking. So I started to upgrade the bottom as much as I could because I didn't want it to mess up. As you can see there, I actually clicked that three times to upgrade to level three. And I messed it up. I don't know why, you just, you just wouldn't click it. As you see here, we're doing pretty good. <laughs> Barely any have got to the bottom or to this corner. Obviously, that will vary on the waves. Obviously, the further the waves, the harder they get. So, just these little like dog things that seem to get through to the corner more than anything. So, my main focus, like I said, to get again is here is the lasers simply because the yellow lives, because the next few waves they do send out a lot more yellow lives in my way. Last thing, last thing I want. So we're getting some more lasers, keeping them all nice bundled there. This is where your rockets come in handy. You see the lasers are doing the job they need to do. As you can see, let's just see because I've moved the screen there. But if you saw there, the, one of my lasers was still focused on one of your lives. Look at the distance on that laser there, right there. Look at that distance. Obviously that doesn't happen. As you can see, that laser in the mid there at the top is actually still focused on the shell life that's coming to the lasers now. Just a bit of advice. Now, I have noticed that if your laser is focused on a yellow life that is way out of their range, if you upgrade that laser, it will take off the aim. So if you plan on upgrading the laser, but if that laser is already fixated on a target, do not upgrade it because it will stop shooting at it because you have to upgrade it to stop. They will target the next ones closest to it. I did notice this in Infinite Zombies, which I did a video on, which I will be posting in a few days to see how my score increases. Um, uh, and I kind of messed it up. So, because I didn't realise when you upgraded the laser, it took off the target even though the target was like over across the other side of the map. So as you can see here, we're doing pretty well. We're up to wave five out of seven. Dropping them, like I said, all of the yellow lives and the dogs have made it to the corner and not even majority of your lives have made it to this corner yet. Even that big guy got dropped before. And so we're moving on to the next wave soon. So you look at these, oh, apart from that, they always seem to get through because as soon as the yellow life gets destroyed, it bursts into little things. So now we're on to wave six out of seven. Now this is where usually, without this bug, this is the wave I usually struggle on. So yes, I do usually, I make it to wave six or seven, but then I end up getting done over by the last boss or some of these yellow lives here. Or occasionally, sometimes these little dogs seem to get slipped through. So look at all that bunch there. So this is the way where I, I was, like I said, I was struggling. And you now you can see how easy I passed this. Because look at that, the laser's distance is still shooting on that yellow life. Still reducing it. It should have come to me like half-life there. But the lasers just aren't stopping. They're hitting the target and they're just staying with the target until it's gone. See, look at that, the, that laser in the mid. It's actually shooting this yellow life down here. It's got yellow lights right in front of it. It just sticks with it. So here we come to the final boss now. This is the final wave. Like I said, I've made it to the final wave before with full health. But this was where I was unsure of going. I absolutely forgot about the boss at first. So I've had to pause it here. And this is where I reduce my rockets and increase my lasers. So we're tricked in a few lasers. See no misclick there. Increase axe obviously you need to focus on the shell life. So there we go, increase my lasers as much as I can right now. Let them shoot at the last boss. Which looks like the Doom's Iron Grip light. So I pause it again. Just to increase some more. Because although it is a bug. My main focus still was to destroy this guy. So obviously I started increasing everything while I targeting him. 
So there we go, come up to it. So I'll remove that, just another laser. More lasers on it, the better. Then I ballsed it up by removing that. I absolutely thought that was a rocket. Didn't pay attention to what we we're doing. Right now I was swearing at myself because I realised that I ballsed up on it and it's now not a target in it. So I didn't think about replace, you know, replacing the laser because there's no point now. Because I've removed it, the bug stopped. Now watch this laser here at the bottom in the left corner there. It's still shooting at the boss. Now look at all them lasers. I've never seen so many lasers attack one boss. Just look at all that. How beautiful is that? So increase that one because it hasn't targeted him yet. Just looking round, scaring round. Remove that because we didn't need any more rockets. Increase my turret there. I should upgrade that just because these I don't want these little dogs to get through because they are quite annoying, they have slipped through before. There you see, still full health. All the little ones are gone. I was going to remove that rocket and put another laser, but that's why it's health because of all these nice, beautiful yellow lines zapping it all the way from all the way over there. And then bushk. So if you like this, please leave it a like. If you haven't already, please subscribe. And tell them about the bell notification for any of your YouTube videos. Like I said, I will be posting up the Infinite Zombies uh, improvement to my score, even though I didn't do it before. But until the next time, my cubbies. Take care.